Hi guys, so welcome back to my channel and if you're new here then hey and welcome to my new home So I'm so excited to be vlogging from here. It's basically like my first full day in the home today So me and Chris moved in yesterday. We got the keys But for the past few days we've just been on the go like packing unpacking and removing stuff and putting it in here Because basically I used to live in the Midlands So we had to pack all my things up from the Midlands drive down which took hours um, And it took so long to pack all my stuff up because I didn't realize how much stuff I actually have I'm a bit of a hoarder so I need to cut down on all of that and just minimize my life basically um, and then we had to come back to London pack all of Chris's things and then bring it all over to the house yesterday so it's just been very stressful the past few days but it's still been so exciting for us obviously we're moving in together which is really exciting um, but yeah I wanted to do like a grand tour and show you the place I filmed some bits yesterday when it was empty so I'll kind of like clip into them so you can see it empty um, we haven't done a lot already obviously it's only been like a day so we've got, still got so much to do um, loads of furniture to buy loads of little bits and just make it our home which is going to be so exciting because I feel like I'm just obsessed with interiors like I love going home shopping I feel like I could actually say I probably love it more than fashion but borderline um so yeah when we got the place it was come furnished but we decided to like remove some stuff and keep some things um like this bed for instance this was brand new that come with it um and we loved it but like the bed covers and stuff we've got to get brand new ones and like we want to make it dress the bed really nice there's loads of little bits like that that need changing um, but our sofa actually arrived yesterday which was amazing the fact it arrived the first day we moved in um so we got that up and honestly removal men were, the removal men were amazing they literally they walked in the house, put the sofa down, turned around, it was just all done and up and a mate like perfectly done so I was just so impressed with that the service was in like sane so I'll link down below where the sofa is from I'll show you that it's actually from the sofa club and I couldn't recommend them enough like the removal men did it all for us it was so fashion efficient and like they were texting us beforehand say like they were 30 minutes away and stuff so it was just amazing service so if you're looking for a sofa you can check them out and obviously I'll link the one that we've got down below and any of the little bits that I've already put in the house I'll try find the links for them because I've been picking bits up um, that we've put in just like lamps things like that and stuff that we've brought from our old places but like I said there's going to be so much more to come so make sure you hit subscribe to see a lot more homeware on here but yeah I'm excited to show you the house so here we go hi guys so welcome to our new home come inside and I'll show you around so this is the porch bit so in a minute it's just got our coats here on the hanging rack and then this is the shoe rack which is completely full of Christmas shoes so this is just like the little bit before you walk into the house and if you come in, in, I'll show you around. So you come in from the front door, we've got like the porch area, which I just showed you. And then this is like the main door coming in. And then I put these posts up yesterday. So these are from my old um, home. They're from Dezenio. I love them. So they've got the cake moss one and then the Chanel one. So these just actually go perfectly here. And then I'll take you up the stairs. So this leads up to like, obviously the main house. Not sure what we're going to do on this wall yet, maybe just leave it plain for now. And then you come up, so this is like a bit leading to the corridor. And then we've got a little cupboard here. So this is really handy actually, it's just got all of our bits in, like uh, ironing board, iron, and cleaning bits, which works really perfectly that it's just stored away. And then in here, I think this is like my favourite room in the house, it's like the living room and obviously the kitchen, it's all like open space. So we'll take you through. So this is it so far. It is so nice in here. And I think like the one thing that sold us was obviously the skylights up here. So it just brings so much light into the place. And then this like massive window area here, which leads out onto the patio. So we really love that. So this wall at the minute here on the side is obviously empty, but we've got these Dizenio prints that arrived. So it's actually been handy that everything arrived for some time. So we've got these, which we're actually going to put up this afternoon. I'm going to get Chris on the job. Um, so yeah, we're going to put all these up on the wall, which will look really nice. And just make sort of like a gallery wall on there. So that will fill that. And then this is the sofa that we got yesterday, which we absolutely love. So it's from the sofa club and it's the Shigwell right hand corner one. Is that the right way? Shigwell. Chigwell. Chigwell, sorry. In Essex. <laughs> yeah, um, it's the right hand <laughs> corner one. But I love this little bit on it. So it's got this like studded detail here on the armchair and then it follows on onto the footstool. So it's just so nice. And then we put the footstool in and we can just like chill out on here. But these are the cushions that come with it. 
but we're gonna add our own cushions and just sort of like we're not sure what we're gonna get yet but obviously you can keep updated on that should make it a bit more colour on here I think but yeah we love this sofa and it's so comfy so I'll link this down below for you the direct link to it because it's a 10 out of 10 from us and then these little lanterns I actually brought these are from the range if I remember rightly yeah I got both of these from the range I think they were like 20 pound 25 pound and then I just put a big candle in them I've got this thing for lanterns at the minute I just love it and I love candles and then it leads up to here which is really nice it's all open plan so this is the dining at room area. These lights came with the flat, but we've actually got some new ones that we're going to hang in today. Oh, that light is coming through. And they're going to be like rope ones that dangle over, so it should look really, really nice. And this table and the chairs came with the flat as well. So I think in time we'll probably change that. And then we've just got these placemats that I brought from my home. And then I got this plant from the range as well. I think it was like £14. So I think that looks nice here. And then the mirror came with the place as well. So we kind of like this area. We're just going to change bits as we go. And then this is our kitchen, um, which is so nice. So if I hadn't said before, this whole place has been renovated. So we're actually the first ones to move into it. So it's all brand new. So obviously the kitchen's all done out. So I love this like white tiling going through it all. And then the cupboards have this like silver accent, which we're all doing like throughout the lounge and the dining room as well. There's just so much storage space, so obviously already I had to get Prosecco wine glasses. So in here, I've got new wine glasses and then the matching Prosecco ones. I love these, I got these from the range as well. I don't think they were that expensive. So we've got it all going on here, and then these actually came with the place, it's like a show home. These are massive red wine glasses, so I think we might try that out tonight with maybe a roast dinner, which will be nice. So yeah, we've just got so much storage in here. Then here we've got like a washer and dryer which comes in one which is really handy. And then we've got like a brand new cooker, um, oven. So yeah, it's really nice in here and it's just, I love how it's all open plan. And then these actually were really cool. They've got the USB chargers in with the plug sockets. Obviously we can charge our phone whilst we're cooking and stuff. So yeah, I'll lead you through mainly to the living room so you can see that. So yeah, leading out of here, this rug actually I got from home. Look at this light that's coming through, it's so beautiful. So these windows actually match them ones, which is really nice. It kind of like reminds me of like New York style apartment with this black going on. But yeah, this rug I brought from home, I think it was from either Dunelm or Ikea. I'll try to find a link for you guys below. Got a brand new fancy bin. And then yeah, you lead through here. So I'll also put a clip in now so you can see what it looked like empty yesterday compared to what we've done with it now. So obviously it's really empty at the minute because we moved the sofa and everything out. But we've actually got our new sofa coming in like 30 minutes I think it is. So that's exciting. So we're going to put the sofa here. It's like an owl shaped one. And then on this wall we've got all prints coming which I said before. So that would be really nice. We're going to frame all this and make all this like living area really homely. So on the footstool, I brought these um, bits with me. So this is from HomeSense, this tray. I, I saw it and absolutely loved it. But with HomeSense, obviously, they only do like one-off pieces. So we love doing this like mirror effect um, through the house as well with the silver touches. This is from the range, this candle holder. I just need to put a candle in there. And then this diffuser is from Aldi. I love Aldi for their um, candles and diffusers. So it's the pomegranate. And then Joe Malone kindly um, gifted me my favourite candle, which is pomegranate noir, um, for moving into my new home, which was so lovely of the girls on the team. This actually is from H&M Home, if I remember rightly. I need to take the sticker off it, though. And then just the Joe Malone candles, and then underneath is a little fashion book. So we'll probably play around with this. It might change, but this is it set up for now. And then my Chanel book, which I also brought from home. So I think this just looks nice on the footstool. It kind of like acts as a coffee table. And then behind here, we've got this little glass shelves going on. I've just put some little bits in there for now. This will definitely change. Um, so I'm just going to like fill it with really nice pieces, like picture frames, books, little ornaments. So I really like this little touch. And again, it's like this mirror effect going through. So it just makes the room look so much more open. So on this wall opposite to the sofa, obviously I've shown you guys the lanterns. And then these little candle holders I got from HomeSense. Ignore the fact it's got one random silver candle and not in the other. I'm going to make them pretty and put like sand and stuff in them. Then the TV is Chris's. And the TV unit came with the house, which was amazing. So we could got like a good bit of storage in there. 
This is the wallpaper behind it, which I wasn't actually keen on, but I think it kind of works with the whole like black theme running throughout with the doorway here and also it carries on into the dining room and then we've got the shelf in here which came with it so that's really good for storage again and then obviously I'm going to put stuff above so I'm not sure what I'm going to do there yet but I'm going to make it look pretty and then walking through here is like my favorite little open bit so these lights at the top they're kind of like industrial they're going to be the same ones as the one hanging over the dining table that I mentioned earlier and then this planter and the table actually claim with the place which we absolutely love so it's got this like marble effect the only thing is is it's gold on the bottom and obviously everything throughout the place is silver so we'll see what we can do with that and then these plants are amazing we just need to keep them actually i think they're they're not real they're fake oh yeah amazing they are they're fake so that's fine and then this is literally the reality of moving in we've just shoved everything behind the sofa for now like the laundry basket and stuff which we need to sort out and then you come through here onto the patio so we've got the olive tree here, which came with the place, which is so nice. We're hoping to get some olives out of that. Um, we've got the storage shed, which we've put everything in. And then this bit is so nice. So it actually came with the place. So these mirrors and then the hanging baskets, which are actually the plants are fake. So we don't have to like maintain them, which is amazing. So yeah, this table and chairs came with the place. We're gonna get these out and we're thinking of doing like a massive corner sofa here or something or like a dining table outdoors and then put again, probably some lanterns and plants and stuff. My mom said she'll help me with that, which would be really nice. And then we've got this at the minute, which I think we might get rid of. Ignore the cushions on there. We just put that on the, this morning. It basically stores all of our um, trash underneath, which is really handy actually for now. So yeah, this is our little outdoor patio area. So I'm so excited to start like, designing this and put stuff in it because it's so nice the sun's gone in at the minute but the light hits here in the morning and it's just amazing and we also really wanted like an outdoor area so it's nice that it leads out from the living room. I have got to show you guys a feature that we really liked in the living room is the aircon unit, which is amazing. Like I said, it's completely renovated this place. So they've added in all these new touches. So we've got one here and then one in the master bedroom. This like window area here is really nice. Again, it just like lets in the light. Got a little intercom thing and that's obviously for the aircon. You lead back into the corridor. So this mirror actually come with the place, which I like. It matches the wall. Um, so the walls are like the same throughout. It's kind of like this duck egg gray color, which is actually really nice. It just adds like a bit of like character and homey feel. And then this lamp I brought from my old place. I can't even remember where it's from. I think it was from the range. And then I love this picture frame. We got it from Zara Home and put these black and white pictures in of us. And then Neon kindly sent me some candles. So I thought this mat went perfectly in here. I actually got this little container, like candle thing from Home Sense, And then this little post thing came with the place as well. This wicker basket isn't gonna stay down there, but Chris's mom kindly gave us like a little housewarming present and it's little um, picnic baskets. So it's got all the stuff in there as well. So we need to try that out. And then another lantern, which is here, I brought from home. If I remember rightly, it was from Dunham, I think. On this wall leading through to the corridor, these pictures are Chris's. These are from his old place. I actually really like them. They're like this James Dean theme. And they completely just go on this wall with the black and white. Um, so they worked out really perfectly on here. And then this is my favourite bit. So it's like this whole mirrored door, which just makes the corridor look bigger. But in here is literally the reality of moving. So I'll clip into yesterday when I showed you this room when it was empty, because this is actually the second bedroom. It did have a bed in it, but we took it out because obviously I'm gonna make it into like my office and dressing room. So I'll clip into the bit where you can see it empty. Okay, so this is the second bedroom, which I'm actually obsessed with this. It's got a mirror on either side of the door. Um, I just thought that was a really nice touch. So this actually had a really nice bed in here. But we've had to take it all out because this is going to be like my office space and dressing room. So to start off with, it's actually really good because it's got all these fitted wardrobes, which is amazing for me to store all of my things. So in here, there's like the two rail things for like long coats, dresses. So there's just so much storage space for me, which is amazing. We put all my bags and shoes. And then in here, we've got the drawers, which is so perfect for like socks, pants, things like that. This one, again, I can store like, my handbags and stuff all neatly. And then this one, again, is like rails. So it's just so much storage, which is perfect for me to have all my clothes in here. But as you can hear, in the background, we've got the delivery men bringing the sofa right now. So yeah, I think I'm gonna paint this all white, we'll see though. But it's got all these nice big windows here. 
which I think is where I'm going to put my desk and like my workspace. And then obviously we've got people to come and stay, so we're going to get a sofa bed, so we're going to fit that in here. And then I also have some open units where I put my clothes, and I'll put all my pictures and stuff on here. So this is going to be completely transformed. And then I'll show you now the reality of it, so you can see sort of behind the scenes of how messy it is and how much unboxing we have to do. So this is all of my stuff, basically. So I've got suitcase on suitcase, um, and just boxes and boxes full of things. All my clothes, my desk, which is just full of like shampoos and stuff at the minute. And then as you can see here is all the built-in wardrobes, which I'll show you inside when they were empty. So I'm excited to organize all my clothes into there because it's just gonna look so nice and neat. But yeah, as you can see, I'm a bit of a hoarder so I've got to get rid of so much stuff so I think tomorrow I'm just going to spend hours doing this and then these are my units my Ikea units that I had in my old place which just also stores a lot of my clothes so I think I'm going to put it on this wall and then we're also going to get a sofa bed in here so we can have guests come to stay as well which will be really nice and I'll just have it in theme with my office so you can stay tuned to see how I'm going to renovate this little room well it's not even little it's actually such a good decent size and the light comes in really nice here so there's a door actually behind all this clutter which is in here um, and this leads through to the ensuite which I'll show you Obviously, I've got to go through this door, which leads from the corridor into here. So this is the downstairs bathroom slash ensuite for like the guest room. She's actually really nice. It's all brand new. So there's this mirror effect going through it again. And this is all storage cupboards, which we can put all of our beauty things. I say we, my beauty things and Chris's toiletries. And then it's got this like gray slate going through, which is actually really nice. It's just like really minimalistic. Brand new loo, loo roll, little bin. And then these actually came with the place, which was nice, um, but I've just put in my Aldi soap and hand cream. And then this is the amazing shower, which we've tried out and tested, and this is actually our favorite shower down here. Um, so the shower head is massive, but it's just so nice and powerful, and it's so big in there. So actually, I'll shut this door. So yeah, we've got a really nice big shower in here, which is such a nice touch. So then actually if you come out the bathroom and um, behind me and the corridor is this door which leads up to our little hideaway. So you come up here, I've put another lantern there, I'm probably going to move it. Um, this big one is again I think from the range, I got all my lanterns from there if I remember rightly. And then we've got this glass effect, um, a mirror going here on the shelves which you're going to just put so much nice stuff on here like picture frames and little bits sort of that mirrors the one in the living room so you come up these stairs and this leads up to like the second level which is the master bedroom so there's a little shelf here which again I think I'm going to put some like candles and lanterns on we'll see and then this is our other favorite room in the house we absolutely love it it's just so big and spacious but obviously there's just so much to do in here so this is going to be Chris's wardrobe. So I think he's mainly put all of his stuff in here. Yeah, he's actually really organised. He's unpacked and put all of his stuff in completely the opposite of me right now. These curtains we think we're going to change and have the same in the second bedroom, well, slash my office as well. So these lamps that are on here are still packaged up. We actually got these from, I think we got them from HomeSense. Oh, wait, no, actually, it'll say on here. We got them from TK Maxx, was it? Either TK Maxx or HomeSense, but they were 24 dollars um, They're just really nice. It's like white with the clear and the silver. So we're gonna put them on the bedside tables, which we haven't yet got. We're gonna get mirrored bedside tables either side. We absolutely love this bed. It's like super king, so it's absolutely huge. Like last night, we both were starfishing it. This rug um, is gonna go. We're gonna change this for like a white rug. And then above the bedside tables, we're gonna put mirrors either side, I think, to just make it more spacious again and like open up the room. And then we've got an air con unit above which is so handy because obviously the weather's a bit muggy in the minute so please ignore this suitcase right here and everything that's going on and the bed we're going to completely dress it with like massive pillows and obviously new bedding and stuff at the minute we've just got the basic um, my little teddy which is there that i brought with me and then we've got another skylight which we love so in this corner this sofa actually came with the place and i really really like it it's like this silver crush and then these two pillows were mine I brought with me from Laura Ashley and these came with it but this is going to be my little reading corner like I love it with the light coming in here and then we've got a storage cupboard unit there which leads back and then another one here 
So we've got so much space in here that we can store loads of things, which was so essential as, like I said, I've got so much stuff. Then on this side of the bedroom is this mirror, which is so nice because it leads on from the bed. So it's really, really big, so I love this. So I've got actually a big silver mirror, which is in the other bedroom. I keep saying bedroom, but it obviously it's gonna be my office. So we were gonna put this up here, but we actually didn't need it because this came with it. And we really like this. And then in this little cupboard here, is our TV, which is perfect because we can sit in bed and watch TV and it's just so snug. So we had a little Sunday morning, cuddle in here this morning and we're watching Friends, which was really, really nice. And then there's a cupboard above, which we're just gonna put all our bedding in. So like I said, I keep repeating it, but there's just so much storage in this place, which is amazing. And then this is our favorite bathroom. This is our ensuite, and it's just so nice and quaint in here. Like I love this tiled floor. It's kind of got like a green, um, like dark green going through it with the black. And then this panelling, and then it's just mirrored everywhere, which is amazing. Um, these lights came with it, which are really, really nice. I'm not sure where they are from. And these came with it as well. And obviously it's got the silver twitches going through. So I love this mirror effect. And then another skylight in here. So it just brings in so much light again. And then the mirrored um, wall on here as well with the same light. So we've kind of put little bits in the minute. We've just got a little mirror, my Jo Malone perfumes. Gonna make a little section here for all the perfumes and stuff. This basket came with it. I've just put some towels in at the minute, like some face towels. These little plants are from Ikea. And then this, I'm not sure it came with it, but it's so handy for little cotton wool buds and stuff. And then I'm gonna get some white baskets and put them in here. We're gonna store all of our toiletries, which is amazing. And these towels for now, we've just brought from home, but we're gonna get some new ones. We just want like some big fluffy ones. So this is our little bathroom. We absolutely love it. And it's, I was like getting ready this morning, put my makeup on, it's just such good lighting. And then here is our shower, which again is the same tiling as the kitchen. So it all matches in together. It's just so nice. And it's got all the silver touches. And obviously it's just brand new. So the shower head is massive as well. So yeah, that is basically the whole house guys so I feel like I've shown you everything but like I said we've still got just so much to do um, in the place and we're just so excited to start doing it up and buying all our furniture and everything so make sure you hit subscribe so you can see the updated house tour when I start to make this our little home and if you did like this video then make sure you give it a like because I'm going to be doing so much more like home stuff and interiors on here and also you can follow me at all Chloe Rose to see any updates over there but until next time guys I will see you then